St. John. Hey, Cope, what's up? Just checking in. A couple of my men were up at the top of Leary Mountain the other day. So they found a safe house set up in an old Forest Service watchtower. Okay, Ricky, I'm near Eden Hill. Yeah, Drifter's still here. Can you handle it? Well, I guess we'll know soon enough. Beacon out. All right, gentlemen. I thought you'd just swing by, shoot up the place. Nah, I just think it's time you move along. There we go. One more. Yes, sir, that's what I'm told. They said it was abandoned, but funny thing. Whoever lived there left behind a bike. Good shape, too, by the sound of it. Really? Indeed. That's not the funny thing. The funny thing is they went back up there today to pick it up, but the bike was gone. Now, ain't that a hit scratcher? Look, Copus is all really fascinating, but, uh... Now, hold on. Here's the fascinating part. They swear that old bike, well, it looked a lot like the one Boozer used to ride. Okay, so let me get this straight, Cope. You guys went up to O'Leary Mountain. You found what you thought was Boozer's bike. And the first thing you thought of was, hey, why don't we just go back and steal it? Salvage, Dick. Salvage. But no, that was my second thought. My first was, whatever happened to old Boozer? Manny says he hasn't seen him around for some time. I don't know, Cope. Next time I see him, I'll let him know how much you miss him. St. John out! Okay. Time to run for it, Joanna. Let Ricky know. Yeah. Deacon, how'd it go? It's done. They won't be shooting up any more camps. Whew. Thank God. I'll let Iron Mike know. You know, keep this up and you and Mike are gonna be best friends before you know it. 
Maybe. Deke, tracked down those boys, shot up the gate, and took off. Hey, Mike, yeah, uh, I found them and they won't be coming back. Hey, Mike, yeah. Uh, I found them and they won't be coming back. Seem like it's getting worse. A lot of squatters and drifters we got coming through. No offense to present company. <laughs> Take it. Uh, and yeah, Mike, it's getting worse. I don't know. Mike, I think it's like you were saying about tourists always coming up here from California. Well, I guess if I had the choice, yeah, I'd rather be here than down there. Yeah, I guess so. See you, Deke. Iron Mike out. Deacon, you there? Yeah, Addy, what's up? Can you stop by the infirmary when you get a chance? Anything wrong? No, I just need to talk to you. Ah, uh, yeah, okay. Today, man. Addie said she'd heard enough of my whining to last her a lifetime. Yeah, sounds like Addy. How's the arm? You know, it's about 50% there. <laughs> Sorry, a little angry. That did it. Seriously, though, it's like I can still feel my right hand, you know? Yeah, I think they call that phantom pain. Yeah, yeah that's what Addie said. It, it fucking sucks. I feel pain in my finger joints, you know? Like, after a long ride, your hand gets gummed up. And to flex it and... Anyway, I, I gotta get going. Skizzle got me on farm duty. I'm gonna see if I can uh, pay off these damn pay meds that Addy has me on. Later. Later.
Hey, uh, Deacon, can you stop by? Oh, let me guess. You got a job for me. Yeah, okay. St. John out. Hey, look. Someone's here. Hey, let me in. It's okay. Open up. Deacon, you got a second? How's William? I haven't seen him lately. How's Boozer? How the hell are any of us? He's surviving. Yeah, well, then he's doing better than most. Yeah. Listen, you need to keep an eye on him. What do you mean? Well, losing an arm is a big adjustment. He's given up the life he had. <sighs> Wasn't much of a life, Addy. I You're his friend. The only one he's got. Boozer's fine. He'll live anyway. What can I get you? Yeah, good part, that one. I'll be here, if you need me. Stop by any time. Ah, Deacon St. John. Hey, Joe. Uh, yep. Yeah, see you, Deke. Deke, Deke, Deke. <laughs> What's been keeping you away so long? Hey, Blair, how are things in the gun trade?
Yeah, good. Okay, then. <laughs> Don't be such a stranger. Hey, Deacon. Let me get the gate for you. Nero's out here, or they're running fuel missions, studying the freaks. No idea. Hey, I gotta get going. Schizo stopped by. Said I'd be shoveling shit all day. Tell Schizo to eat shit. Yeah, I'll pass that along. Later. Man, how you doing? I got work to do. <laughs> See you later. Someone's at the gate. Open the gate already. It's all right. Open up. Hey. Nothing. Okay. That's your best bet. Right there. I don't know about that, Mike. We lost people in there before. We, lo we lost who? When? A few weeks back. 
Torres and Evans, looking for supplies. I told you that no, they No, were... goddammit, you didn't! I told you that we went after them, but the entrance ah. was caved in. Their bikes were outside, but the place was crawling, you remember? I don't even know if they made it inside. What's the trouble? Ah, uh, we just... We're going over the papers, the ones from Sherman's camp. Mm -hmm. There's a mine that was getting ready to expand. Sure, and there's probably explosives stored on site. Yeah. Except now Schizo tells me we may have lost two men on the inside. Hey, I never said that, Mike. Well, look, I, just, give me the map, I'll go get the explosives, and Mike, hey, the people will. inside. What the hell is going on? You may trust him, Mike, but I don't. Tell me, how much is Tucker paying for a box of TNT these you know, days? Huh? Hold on, he's doing his part. Oh, really? He's doing what? Besides breaking the treaty with the Rippers, skipping work, staying out with Ricky all day, what's he been doing, huh? What you been doing, huh? Sitting on your ass while everyone does all the work. I keep this camp safe mm. from marauders, thieves, and drifters. You knock it off. Knock it off! Hey, you don't trust him? You go with him. Do you remember some? Both of you, remember, we are all part of the same camp. That's fine. Fine by me. In the morning, we'll take our bikes and we'll go. We'll go right now. <sighs> now. Yeah. Now. In the middle of the night. Sure. You know, it's dark out. There'll be less freaks inside the mine. Oh, that's right. Oh, since you've been skipping work, you've been chasing down black choppers, and now you're some kind of freak expert. Don't need it? to be a fucking expert to know that the freaks come out at night. So okay. Oh, yeah? Come on, enough already! Okay. Okay. You want to go now? We'll go now. But I'll hold on to this. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Hey, look, he's got his issues, just like everybody else does. Deke, I guess I'm just making sure he's not going to have some kind of accident down in that mine. Oh, Jesus, Mike, who do you think I am? I'm still trying to figure that out. See you when you get back. <sighs> Son of a bitch. Where are we going? Lucky lad, know where it is? Yeah. <clears throat> I'll be waiting for you. Yeah, try to keep up. Deacon, you there? This is Lost Lake Camp. Over. Yeah, Ricky. What's up? I stopped by to see you. Obviously, you're not there. Schizo and I are on a run for Iron Mike. I'll be back by morning. What's up? I just wanted to see what we could get out and fix that transformer. <laughs> that hot shower still calling your name? Something like that. <laughs> we'll be back by morning. Talk to them. Geeking out. you were going to be waiting for me. I got sidetracked. So these belong to Mike's men? My men? But yeah. Torres and Evans. They weren't drifters, but they'd been out in the shit a few times. I thought they could handle it. I guess you were wrong. Shit's already been parted out. Goddamn scavengers everywhere. It's because of why wouldn't you bring their shit back with you when you were out here looking for them? Because there were too many freaks. <laughs> That's why. Like them. Only a lot more. Come on. Now Mike said the explosives are kept locked in strong boxes. Should be a set of spare keys somewhere inside the office. Fucking nuts. God, I hate those little suckers. We finally agree on something. There we go. Door's locked. Can we force it open? Nah, it's jammed with something from the inside. 
No idea. Gotta find another way in. Hey, over here. I think I can boost you onto this roof. Ready? Get more on ammo. Gizzo! I got him. Great, great. Look around. Uh, see if you can find some flares. Wait a second. You didn't bring a flashlight? Yeah, but the batteries are dead. Shit's getting hard to find these days. At least ones that have any juice left. Flares. Gizzo! I found a box of flares. Yeah, yeah, see if you can force open the door. I'll come in and grab them. Flares are over here. Yeah. Give me the keys. What, you mean like these keys? Yeah, I can't Hey, them. hey, hey, I got an idea. How about you lead us to the strong boxes, I'll unlock them. You got a problem with that? No problem. Just don't lose them. Mm. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna keep that in mind. I got him. Let's head in. Right behind you. See? It's just like I said. Looks like we should be able to squeeze in through here. Give me a hand. Here, push. I'm pushing, I'm pushing. There. Wedge it against that boulder. Oh, got it. There. <sighs> Looks stable to you. Stable enough. Remember, keep your gun holstered. I thought you said it was gonna be clear. I never said that. And I mean it, if there are any freaks in here, one shot will bring them right down on our heads. I heard you already. Jesus. Okay, first expansion area is right off the main shaft. Come on this way. Right behind you. Ah, shit, we're not getting none of that. Look at the map. Is there another tunnel? A ventilation shaft? Map shows they started a connecting tunnel here. Looks like it was unstable, so they boarded it up. Where? Uh, back this way. Ha! Here? Yeah. Yeah, looks like they boarded it up. Stable. 
I thought I already said that. All I got is this. You got the flashlight. You had the honor. Maybe there's a reason they never completed any of this expansion work. I mean, it seems like one stick of dynamite will bring this whole place down on our heads. Uh, it doesn't seem so bad. Shit now! Come on. This way. What are you doing? What's it look like? We're dropping players. Why? You got the map. This thing's a fucking maze. Gonna need help knowing which tunnels we checked. We go left here. Got it. Come here. What? These are men. Yeah. Every time I saw Torres, he had on this same damn vest. I kept telling him, wearing bright orange is gonna get you killed, bro. I guess it didn't matter here. His buddy lost the arm blood out and kept Taurus fed for a week. You have a resort to that? A few lines I haven't crossed, that's one of them. Yeah. Me either. Stand back. I'm not leaving him for the freaks. Come on, we can squeeze through here. Following you. That's a tight squeeze. You got this? Who sits on his ass all day in the camp? Oh, very funny. Come on. Okay, the first expansion area should be around this corner. If you're reading the map right. I'm reading it right. See? You still got the keys? Yeah, right here. <clears throat> Nothing. It's empty. Shit. Oh, I'm sorry. Did you not believe me? Sure. I believed you. Come on. Maybe they put them all in one place. Go check the other one. This way. Let's double back. Make sure we didn't miss any side tunnels. Excuse me, hold, hold up, hold up. This doesn't seem right. What? What are you talking about? This isn't the way that we came in. What? You think these flares got up and moved themselves? Maybe I got turned around. Oh, now, wait a minute, God damn it! Th this is the main tunnel. What? It's the, it's the main tunnel, you see the tracks? We weren't following any tracks on our way in. What the hell? But, but these are my flares, damn it. How did the... Someone's fucking with us. Come on, this way. 
Hold up, hold up. Wait a second. Who the hell's in here? Come on out! Show yourself! I guess who put that thing away? What are you talking about? What I'm talking about is one shot. One. It's all it takes to bring all the freaks in these tunnels down on top of us. Well, I thought you said these tunnels will be clear this time. No. Ah! What the hell? Look ah! out! I can't get a shot! Ah! Oh, God damn it! God damn it, it's got the keys! Shit! Where are you going? It's got the keys! We gotta catch it! Wait! Come back! God damn it, Skizzo! It's getting away! if you fired your weapon. What was I supposed to do? Throw rocks at him? supposed to do is you're supposed to fucking listen to me. Next time, try this. Whatever. You're welcome. For what? For saving your ass. If you hadn't run off, my ass wouldn't need to save you. <laughs> Are you ready to fucking finish this? Yeah. I'm ready. This way. Rose off. Addy said it looked like someone tried to burn his tats off. There's rippers, wasn't it? You got a point, Schizo? Had a drifter coming. Word's gone out. Rippers are looking for two men. Mongols sound like anyone you know? Well, as you can see, I'm still wearing the cut. We're not hiding, Schizo. Carlos wants Boozer. He won't have any trouble finding him. But he's gonna have to go through me first.
What'd you do to him? Gotta be something long before breaking the treaty. Long before? You know what? I don't know and I don't care. Have I killed a few rippers in my day? You're goddamn right I have. And after what they did to Boozer, I'm gonna go right on killing the crazy sons of bitches. Yeah? And Carlos is crazier than any of them. You don't want to be on his shit list, bro. What'd I just say? I don't care. And I'm not your bro. Remember what I told Iron Mike? Carlos can go fuck himself. Hey, just looking out for you. You're one of us now, right? Yeah, yeah right. Don't worry about me and Boozer. We can look out for ourselves. This ought to make the old man happy. Shit's heavy. What are you talking about? You know the old man. Same with me. I got this. Got it. He thinks that his treaty with the Rippers is gonna keep us safe. The thing is, they don't give a shit about any treaty. The only reason they haven't come down here in force is because they're too busy up north, hitting Copeland, the hot springs. Yeah, I know I was there. So you know what I'm talking about. The Rippers are coming. And Iron Mike is just gonna let it happen. He's gonna let those bald-headed freak-alikes wash over us like a goddamn red tie. Excuse so you don't know that. See the light of day. Shit, something else we agree on. That's twice in one day. <laughs> Hold up for a second. There's someone out there. Hey, bike. Someone's inside. Hey, what the hell? Riding out there. Oh. Sit in your pants. Come on now. Find the brothers. Come on. Find him. Mister, my boy's got a little rambunctious. I admit it. Alright, uh, uh, split up. Here, you know? We'll surround him. Hey, sister. I thought you just wanted to talk. Well, I guess. That's all I gotta say. Something's What's here. That? You hear something? Yeah, you got it! Got Lay it, it into him! Ha! <laughs> Give it to him! I think that's all the bastards. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. We gotta get that box of dynamite. Must have been the same assholes who parted out the bikes. Ride by and they see ours. I figured they'd make an easy score. I guess it wasn't as easy as they'd hoped. You know... I hate to say it, but we actually make a good team, you and I. Well, then don't say it. Hey, there's something I gotta say. When you and Boozer rode into camp and Iron Mike welcomed you back again with goddamn open arms, I thought it was another sign the old man was losing it. Going soft. Okay, what's your point, Scott? My point is that you and me, we see eye to eye. I get that now. You know, same as me. If Iron Mike don't wake the hell up, the camp's not gonna last another six months. Okay, still waiting for your point. Look, I know I've been busting your balls. We both know that. But... A lot of people know what you've done. For your friend. How you been doing shit for the camp.
Changes are coming, brother. When Iron Mike retires, let's call it, I say you and me, we step up and run the camp together. You and me? Run the camp? <laughs> That's really what you wanted to talk hey, to hear me about. Hear me out, goddammit. <laughs> Just listen to me a minute. Uh -huh. Look, I got a lot of friends on the camp council, and they agree. Most of them say the old man's got to go. Yeah, that's bullshit because Ricky would never go for well, She's as soft as and the old Mike man. And Mike trusts you. Well, that's his mistake. One of many. Well, it ain't gonna be mine. Look, we all do things to survive, CSO. I get that. You remember how I said there's some lines I ain't crossed? Stabbing a friend in the back? That's one of them. Better one old man in the entire camp. You think about that. <laughs>